Mzee na the content kateli himself ndio kufika pale hivyo majibu pia ukapatana na kateli mwingine anaitwa Kabilem ilikuwaaje like uh, ulikuwa umepanga kutoka huko mpatane ama ilikuwa tu kitu rando ah uh, yep alikuwa part of the event so nikiwa pale event ndio tukaonana na yeye tukaongea moja mbili tatu kamwambia content tunafanya akasema ni content kwa fit sana ndio tuka tuko engage tuli engage tulikuwa na interactive session tukiwa huko mm-hmm. we met uh, creators walikuwa kadhaa creators walikuwa kadhaa from different countries mm-hmm. when i said i'll make a i'll compile a report mm-hmm nitashia na wase kitu nyenye tulilan huko na how to make uh, be, because i believe uh, content content direction content imechukua content in the international mm-hmm. and i believe kenya we are part of uh, we are part of that journey because i met a lot of creators from different countries creators so when you wanna create content about food wanna create content about sports wanna create content about mm-hmm. comedy wanna create content about lifestyle mm-hmm. like content creation is so wide and it can accommodate a lot of people mm-hmm. yeah and i thank all my fans and people when you tumekuwa nao hii journey yote eh jua ndio ameshinda kin support na personally i believe in uh, that tukiendelea hivi hivi ndio tuko a very bigger industry ni poa tuki tukiwasha candles za za kila mse so yangu ilikisha waka mimi pia ndawasha mtu mwingine na tuendelea kuwasha kandoli ya kila mse mm-hmm. within time because ndio tu tukue wave like mm-hmm. i remember tukiwa huko tukiwa tukiwa UK kuna napata content creators kama kumi wamekuja kutoka Israel mm-hmm. so na believe next time tuta, tutaenda kama content creators kama maybe kumi wa Kenya hivyo mm-hmm. hivyo as long as mm-hmm. tuko uh, ni powerhouse mm-hmm. yeah